Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing well. My name is Deeraj Chaudhary and today we are going to build an interesting AI image generator, a Gen AI powered AWS Party Rock app using Chain of Thought Prompt. This app will allow you to create stunning images based on your preferences like theme, style, specific elements or the mood that you want to capture into a specific image. So whether you are looking for a beautiful landscape, a futuristic image or an abstract masterpiece, this app can bring your vision to reality seamlessly. So stick around till the end and I will show you how to turn your ideas into reality by using this Gen AI powered AWS Party Rock app. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. So without wasting much time, let's start building. So guys, today we are going to build one of my favorite app that I am really proud of building. And it is going, it is really exciting to have this kind of app where you will provide a text prompt and your ideas into that text will get a image in reality. So it's like putting your ideas to reality. So that is what we are going to do in today's app creation. So on the background, uh, the image that you can see on the screen, this image, apart from the one that I am in the center. Okay, let's take that also. So uh, apart from that, the behind two images that you see, these are being created by AWS Party Rock. So the left side image that you see, it is with the model that is Stability AI. The right side that you see, it is with the model Amazon, uh, Amazon's model that is Amazon Nova Canvas, uh, which has been recently released in last December. So it's going to be a lot of learning and this is going to be a fun learning that you are really going to enjoy. So this specific app I am going to create by using COT prompt, that is chain of thought prompts as part of this weekly series. So let's jump to the prompt to understand what kind of prompt we have written to get such an amazing uh, app output. So uh, over here, you can see uh, the prompt starts from here, where I say create an AI powered image generator app based on user input, which allows users to specify preferences. So you will be able to say, specify your preferences like you can say that which theme, which style, uh, the specific elements that you want to add into the image, and the mode of the image, everything you can mention and based on that, it is going to generate an image for you. So how this image should be created. Now we are going to provide step-by-step -step thought process that is chain of thought into this specific uh, prompt that we have created. So step one, we say that uh, uh, the app should accept theme or the subject on based on which the image has to be created. The second, uh, and once it is taken, then based on that, it has to uh, create the background then the preferences so what kind of preference so there are many uh, famous artists so if you like any artist style and you want your image to be artistic the same way that a specific artist makes you can mention that too in style preference or you can give some other preferences like visual appearances textures brush strokes and rendering techniques that you want then it will ask for specific elements or objects suppose if i am creating an underwater image so whenever i think of an underwater image or underwater world for sure there would be uh, some remains ancient remains where you will see some broken uh, ancient uh, a big big i would say blocks some uh, ancient uh, cities which has been merged into the water so this kinds of things comes into your mind right so you can put that also into that specific image you can mention that just imagine how beautiful it will look when you can imagine and put that into this specific uh, input. Then the mood, what kind of uh, mood that image should hold and depict. Then the color palette, you can select the color palette as well as then we move towards uh, the image generation logic where we say that after taking all these inputs, it has to generate an image and uh, uh, based on the accurate input it has taken. So this is the image generation logic that we have mentioned over here. Now, once the image generation logic is mentioned, we are talking about the refinements and adjustment to that image. So uh, refinement and adjustment means uh, once the image is created, it's not the final outcome. Suppose if I say that I have created an adventurous image, but I wanted to create a mysterious one. So I will change that and immediately uh, it will allow me to change the image. So it is runtime. The user gives a response, uh, gives input click on play button and boom, the image has been created. So this is what our specific prompt is. Now I'm going to go ahead and 
paste this prompt into AWS Party Rock. So just allow me a moment. Okay, here we go. So here we are on the Party Rock screen. We will click on Generate App. Once we click on Generate App, I'm going to copy the chain of thought prompt over here. And based on that, it is going to go ahead and create the image generator Gen AI powered app for us. Let me click Generate and let's see what is the title. So the title of uh, the specific app is going to be Visio Create. Then the introduction would be there. Then it is asking about the theme input, style input, specific elements that we need to add, color palette, mood and atmosphere, whatever I have mentioned, it has picked everything. That is the beauty of Chain of Thought Prompt and it is going to give us the output. So over here, guys, you can see it has given one introduction, theme input. So these are the uh, theme inputs that has been mentioned over here. And this is the generated image. And if we want to refine that image, we see the channel which can help us to refine the image and make the changes that we want. Now, let me make it a bit presentable app. So for that, I will make some fine tuning. So this thing, I think this is, this space is sufficient. So theme input, style input, specific elements, then I will bring it over here and this should be sufficient. Let's do the same over here. I will bring it here. This looks better, right? Now, uh, okay, I will go ahead and Mm -hmm. let's bring this up it will look better okay it's not so let me make it a bit more small see now okay nowadays this is a new thing which comes in i will click on confirm and let me go ahead over here see guys step by step okay so over here you have the image as well as you have the refined one check so first what i'm going to do is i'm going to provide the theme so the theme is going to be mm -mm, let's start with futuristic city futuristic city so and uh, it should be realistic and uh, i would say specific elements i will say flying cars flying cars and uh, in color palette i would say any color i don't have any preferences for color and for mood i would say mood should be exciting so it should be an exciting image for me now so over here guys these are the five user inputs that the app is going to take that is the theme input the color input so uh, let me first leave the edit. Okay. So these are the five, five input, style input, specific elements, whatever I spoke in the COT prompt, everything is uh, been taken care of, uh, taken care over here in this app. Now, what is this new uh, AI powered widget over here? So this widget is going to club all this input. It will take the input and it is going to create a prompt. So that specific prompt is going to be consumed by this and it is going to generate an image. I will show you how. Now just uh, think that these are the five inputs. Now based on this five input, this is the combined description which is going to generate the query to generate the image. So if I click on play, see a vibrant megapolis stretches towards the crimson sunset. It's gleaming skyscrapers piercing through layers of wispy clouds. So a long one and let's see. Let's do it. Mm. That's really beautiful, guys, right? Really beautiful. So I would try to refine uh, the chat by saying, add flying cars. Let's see. Yes. So, 
it is going to try to incorporate okay and now let's go ahead and run this off let's see what kind of image is getting generated oh yes so this is the kind of image which is getting generated so what i will do so when you keep this a uh, big pro uh, this kind of big output then it is not that sophisticated image see if i click over here right so what i am going to do now i am going to make it short like this same way and uh, let's add one more widget i will show you something interesting so over here okay i'm just going to say combined description and i am going to have the model amazon nova canvas over here okay so and let me change it labels nova canvas this is nova canvas guys and let me change the label for this also this is uh stability ai i will save it now we have uh two uh, different image generator ai widgets so it is going to generate two different uh, images one would be with the model of stability ai which is one of the renowned model and the second is going to be with the new model of amazon nova canvas so let's see uh, how both images images are getting created so what i'm going to do is instead of futuristic city i am going to say adventurous and uh, okay adventurous realistic i won't say realistic i would say okay realistic it's okay realistic and elements i i would say glowing butterflies okay theme mysterious i have to uh, i want uh, this to be mysterious so let's see how it gives the output now time for us to go ahead and run this app let's see what kind of output we are going to get now let's play it so two image creation working together so guys you can see how beautiful images images are getting created it is really crazy now this is uh, from the model of stability ai and this is from the model of amazon nova so both are beautiful this is more realistic that we i was looking for and this is more towards the anime side where you know if i if i look at the image it does not looks that realistic see the kind of color which is been provided over here so this is all about your creativity so you can say anything and it is going to generate an image for you so right now i said adventurous so instead of this the theme i would say uh if i say taj mahal and that is my uh that is the image i created so realistic i will say sunset so i will say atmosphere is cool and any color update now this is uh, going to create a similar image the same that i have used as a thumbnail of this video so let's uh, see every time you uh, run this prompt it is going to give you a separate image but let's see what kind of image it is going to give me over here so let's run it again so this is going to be taj mahal let's see what kind of image it gives okay this this is really good this realistic so it has kept the image as realistic as well as a cool textured image and this is also good but still on the anime side it's not that realistic compared to the left one so this is how guys you can uh, have your app where you can put your ideas to your reality so right now i am just using uh, the theme input as taj mahal or one word input but if you have something in mind where you have to create a futuristic city uh, a mysterious city a lot of thing you can do by using this so if i say over here enchanted forest okay and 
o AFC. O Bayer. Uh, any, any over here. And if I say mode is mysterious. Okay. Now it's all based on your creativity. Now I said enchanted forest, so it is going to be an image of a forest. So we saw Taj Mahal, we saw uh, glowing butterflies, but right now it is going to come up with some uh, creative idea of an image which is going to show an enchanted forest. So, see, such a beautiful image. So over here it is uh, trying to keep it realistic as well as it is also adding some elements to it to uh, make it look beautiful. So this is how you can create a Genia powered uh, image. So tell me in the comments below which image you created and how was the output. So for now what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep both of this output as it is. So when you uh, use this app, you can get two outputs and you decide which one you want. One from the Stability AI or the one from the Nova Canvas. So let me in the comments below which image you have generated and how was the image and what kind of creative inputs you have provided over here based on which you were able to create that image. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching and checking out the AWS Party Rock Gen AI based app. I hope you are excited to try it out and see how easy it can be to use AWS and Gen AI to create something fun and unique based on your prompt and your unique ideas. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials like this. If you have any questions or thoughts, feel free to leave them in the comments below and I would love to help you out. Stay tuned for more videos and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.